Hello everyone, I hope you're having a great day today as per usual, and welcome back to Geometry Dash. In the previous episode, where we played Retro Circles, which was of course an easy 9 circles demon, I mentioned that for the next episode I wanted to do a medium 9 circles demon, since our goal is to try and beat a hard rated 9 circles demon. I gotta stop saying the same words every time. But yeah. <laughs> So this episode, we're going to be doing Fractured Circles by Artsimil, I think, Artsimil, I don't know how to pronounce his or her name, so I'm sorry for that. But yeah, this is a medium 9 circles demon. It's also pretty old. Now, I don't have much to say about this level. Uh, let's start just practicing the beginning here. Uh, I do want to say though, that even though it's a medium demon, I find it easier than retro circles. What I mean by that, okay, first of all, this beginning is, uh, let me, okay, let me die here. I, I don't, I want to talk a little bit and I, I don't want to concentrate at the same time. So even though this level is a medium demon and retro circles is an easy one, I find this one to be way easier when it comes to sight reading and also just reading what's going on around. Because if you remember, retro circles had this one effect where it like glitched on certain places and changed the speed and you know just the whole level just looked like a glitch a big glitch so it was very hard to see and it took me a long time even though it was pretty easy and the waves were pretty like open spaces and stuff like that but fracture circles is way easier to see what's going on around you and I mean at the wave by the way because that is the main game mode in this level I mean, of course, it's a nine circles level. So even though the wave sections are way tighter than retro circles, I still will probably have less uh, trouble passing this level. And it won't take much time, probably. I don't want to jinx it again like I did with retro circles, but I have a strong feeling and I also really like the level. It's very fun to play. Also, I was having a very easy time sight reading while uh, I was practicing on the first time. So it shouldn't take that long, to be honest. But the beginning section here, the cube and the ball, they can be annoying. They're a little bit clunky, which I don't love, but what can we do, I guess? The wave is very fun, though. I really enjoy playing the wave. Let's go. I've heard this song before. Up, up, reverse, okay, ah, that's one place that we can die easily to. It's a little bit of an annoying transition, not gonna lie, <laughs> because you gotta fly through the reverse uh, wave portal, which I believe is also a mini wave change, but you gotta fly into it, which can be a little bit annoying, definitely. I would say that the hardest part uh, of the level is probably that transition, but there are a few other wave parts that I have a hard time at. A few tight sections, one might say. Reverse. Okay, fly through. There we go. Small clicks. Spam, bang, down, spam. Ah, that is a bit of an annoying section as well. I gotta say, the hardest parts are probably the transitions, as you guys can see as well. There we go. Okay, let's do this again. There we go. Okay. Wait. Go, go. Okay. Spam up. Oh, there we go. Spam up, down. <gasps> no! Oh, that was the last spot. That tight section right there is the last hard. Uh, like I said, there are a few hard parts. Mostly the transitions, but there are a few tight wave, sp wave spots. What am I saying? Wave spots? I mean wave corridors <laughs> that you have to go through. And that is the very last one. We could have beaten the level right there. Also that dual wave, which was like at 60% or something, that is pretty tight as well. And you have to wait a little bit before you go into it. So I did manage to do it on first try. Also, if you didn't notice, that was a bug right there, which I really don't like, but what can we do? Okay, 
again, really? Oh man, I'm really enjoying it at least. <laughs> Even though I died there twice and I could have beaten the level twice by now. There we go. Nice. Ba -ba -bum. Bam, 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 bam. GG indeed. How long did it take? I feel like. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, I feel like it didn't take long at all. It took 11 minutes. Pretty good. Well, this time I had a correct feeling, I guess. And I didn't jinx it, which. Yes, finally. <laughs> For one time, I didn't jinx the level. <laughs> I'm honestly not sure how to rate it. I'm like between easy and medium, but there's no option for like an easy medium view. Ah, let's go medium, why not? So in total, it took 230 attempts, which is less than retro circles, I think. Uh, let me check here. 249, so it took 19 attempts less <laughs> to do fractured circles, so wow, okay. That's something. This is so fun though. I really enjoyed it. I don't know. It's probably because of the wave corridors. I mean, the beginning and the end parts, you know, the cube and the balls, they are fine, I guess. Nothing special. And also a little bit annoying at times because they are kind of buggy. <laughs> but man, the wave, it's, it's like kind of creative. There are many corridors you have to pass where you like need to remember to not hold before going through a portal or like you need to remember where to spam or I mean straight wave, not spam, but yeah, I don't know. I really like it. For me, this is a thumbs up for sure. So, um, smile. Well, this was a short recording. <laughs> I was expecting something a little more difficult, not gonna lie, even though I had so much fun. It's such a fun level, man. Um, so I have started practicing like two or three hard nine circle demons. I'm not gonna say which one I'm gonna pick, but there is a level that I really like from the hard nine circle demons that I've practiced. I'm probably gonna choose that one, but man, it's really difficult. It might be my new hardest, honestly. Just to give you a hint, it's a classic. I have no idea if we're gonna be doing that level for the next episode. We're probably gonna jump into an easy or medium demon, to be honest. But anyways, leave a like, leave a comment, tell me your thoughts on this video. And also, if you wanna see a specific demon that you guys want me to play, then just tell me in the comments. Once again, have a great day today, everyone, and that's it. See ya.